Case dismissed. Not guilty of the crime of murder in violation of penal code. The Apple TV Plus series Presumed Innocent, 2024, and the 1990 film adaptation of the same name, both draw from Scott Turow's novel as their source material. However, despite their shared origins, there are distinct variations in the character arcs and plot elements between the two mediums. In the television series, the responsibility of handling the investigation falls upon Detective Alana Rodriguez, rather than Detective Dan Liprenzer, who played a significant role in the original film. This change in the narrative structure allows for a fresh perspective and introduces a new dynamic to the storyline. By placing Detective Rodriguez at the forefront of the investigation, the series explores her unique skills, experiences, and personal journey as she delves into the complexities of the case. This alteration not only adds depth to the character of Detective Rodriguez, but also offers viewers a different lens through which to view the unfolding events. As a result, the series presents an intriguing departure from the film, captivating audiences with its fresh take on the investigative process. In the context of the story, Lippenzer demonstrates unwavering support for Rusty Savage, regardless of the circumstances. However, Alana, recognizing the importance of adhering to legal boundaries, cautions Lippenzer whenever he crosses those lines. The series introduces a significant change by unveiling the shocking revelation that it is Rusty's daughter, Jaden, who is the perpetrator of the crime. This stark contrast to the film, where Rusty's wife, Barbara, is portrayed as the culprit, adds a new layer of intrigue and suspense to the storyline. In analyzing the dynamic between Raymond Horgan and Rusty in both the series and the film, it becomes evident that there are significant differences in their portrayal. In the series, Raymond Horgan exhibits a sense of loyalty towards Rusty, even after discovering his affair with Carolyn. However, in the film adaptation, Raymond's reaction takes a different turn as he chooses to abandon Rusty, feeling deeply betrayed by his actions. The portrayal of Judge Little in the series presents him as a morally upright character who is dedicated to maintaining the integrity of the legal system. However, in the film adaptation, Judge Little is depicted as being entangled in corrupt activities and has a vested interest in ensuring Rusty's acquittal in order to safeguard his own questionable past. Judge Little drops all charges against Rusty in the film Presumed Innocent, which faithfully follows Scott Turow's novel, after concluding that nearly all of the evidence against him is inadmissible. At the film's climax, Rusty's wife Barbara admits that she was jealous and killed Carolyn, she also says that she left enough evidence for Rusty to be prosecuted with the murder, although she did not expect him to be. His adultery with another woman set in motion the events that led to Carolyn's murder, so he, too, feels bad about it, just like Rusty in the program. In addition, Rusty's little kid appears in the film, but he is unrelated to the matter at hand. If you've seen the film Presumed Innocent, you'll think Apple TV Plus is following in the same vein. There are a number of early hints that lead to Barbara in the series. Everyone thinks Barbara did it, even Rusty says as much in the series finale. Since Jaden did not get any screen time whatsoever, the plot twist that implicates her as the killer comes as something of a surprise. How Presumed Innocent Season 1's Ending Sets Up Season 2 In a satisfying conclusion to the first season of Presumed Innocent, the jury finds Rusty not guilty. Nobody outside of Rusty and his wife will likely even be able to guess what transpired at the crime scene, let alone know that Jaden killed Carolyn. Because of this, it's hard to imagine that the same cast will return for Presumed Innocent Season 2. Nonetheless, fresh individuals will take center stage in Presumed Innocent Season 2, which will, as previously said, center on an entirely new murder mystery case. This opens the door to the possibility of crossovers between the two seasons taking place in the same universe. It might even take place in a whole different universe and reveal its judicial drama there. It will be intriguing to watch how Presumed Innocent follows True Detective's anthology model and introduces intriguing new casting options with each season, regardless of the outcome of season 2.